everyone and welcome back to Pixel Sheets. Today we're diving into another tutorial and that is Control E. Now some of you may never have heard of Control E as a shortcut within Excel, but this will be one of the most useful tools you can use when you have data that is either joined or concatenated together that you want separated out. For instance, let's say you have a list of products and prices and you have it come over on some sort of data set as a single cell instead of being separate columns and you want it to be multiple columns. What you can do then is use Control E. So what Control E does is it performs a flash fill and it fills values based on a pattern in adjacent columns. So using control E, it, it Excel analyzes the data and predicts the pattern and sequence based on what is entered. So for instance, uh, here, let's say I want to split this up. Prior to using control E, I'm sure you've all done this before where you're typing in apples, oranges, et cetera, et cetera, uh, putting in prices, splitting them out. You might even attempt to do text to columns to split it out. However, there is a much simpler way of doing this. And that is by typing in one of the entities in the cell. So in this case, apples, clicking the cell right below, hitting control E and Excel will then flash fill with exactly what you wanted to put in there. This works on any piece within. So let's say I wanted the price then as well and separate that out. Put the price in, control E, and it splits it out. Now to re-demonstrate, if I put in oranges and did that, Phil thinks that I'm just trying to fill in oranges. So it's attempting to look at the pattern in the adjacent cell, whereas oranges is in the cell below, so it's not gonna function properly. So just to show again, apples, control E, and it fills. And this works with any type of data set. So let's say you have a date and you want to segment out the year, you want to segment out the month. Uh, it's a string of data and you want to pull information together. You want to combine items into a longer phrase that you're typing out, uh, et cetera, et cetera, apples. It'll work the same way. So just remember, Control E is your friend when you are taking a spreadsheet that has data in not exactly the format that you want it to be, and you want it to split it into a more digestible, easy, manipulatable format for, for functions, rather than typing out individually, taking potentially hours upon hours to do so, control E will separate it out. So thank you very much for listening and watching. I uh, appreciate any kind of subscribes, any questions or comments, please fill them out below. Until next time.